Happy Thanksgiving! I'm Amy, and today I'm making a pumpkin spice cake with cream cheese frosting. This recipe combines pumpkin, cinnamon, ginger, and cloves to make a delicious pumpkin cake. It's great for any occasion, from Thanksgiving to potlucks, or any time you want something sweet. So let's get started. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees and take a nine by 13 pan and spray it with nonstick cooking spray and then set it aside. In a bowl, add four eggs, two cups of sugar, three fourths cup of vegetable oil, and one 15 ounce can of pure pumpkin. Now whisk this together until well combined and then set it aside. In another bowl, add two cups of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, two teaspoons of baking powder, two teaspoons of cinnamon, a half a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of ginger, and a half a teaspoon of cloves. Now whisk this together until it's combined. Now pour your wet ingredients into your dry ingredients. Then stir it together. Now pour the mixture into your prepared pan. Now bake this in the oven for about 30 to 35 minutes or until a toothpick inserted in the center comes out clean. Then remove from oven and place it onto a wire rack to cool completely. To make the cream cheese frosting, in a mixing bowl, add a half a cup of butter softened. Now beat this until it's creamy. Then add one eight ounce package of cream cheese softened. Beat this together until it's smooth. Then add one teaspoon of vanilla and mix it together. Finally, add three cups of powdered sugar. Add half of it and mix it together. Then add the rest of it and beat it together until it's smooth and creamy. Now spread the frosting over your cake once it's completely cooled. And here it is, pumpkin spice cake with cream cheese frosting. And you can change up this recipe by adding chopped pecans, walnuts, raisins, or even craisins. You can add it to the batter or sprinkle them on top. This is also really good with caramel sauce drizzled on it. Now be sure to store this covered in the refrigerator. For this recipe and many more, check out my website at amylynnskitchen.com. You can also find me on social media at Amy Lynn's Kitchen. It's great for any occasion, like Thanksgiving, a pot, a pot, a, pot, oh, a potluck. <laughs> and here it is. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving! <laughs>